uh, Taylor series like this. So let us say that now I want x1, x1 is very very close to x0. Then what happens? I get x0 plus uh, f dash of x0 into you are substituting the value of x as x1. So x1 minus x0 plus f double dash of x0 by 1 by 2 factorial into wherever x is there you are substituting x0. So plus etc. Okay. So I hope yeah now you can see that. So wherever x is there substitute x1. Now if we want to call h as equal to x1 minus x0 that is x1 is obtained as x0 plus some small step size h. h is called step size. Okay. Step size. It should be extremely small. Okay. The more smaller it is, the better our approximation will be. That's what you have just now seen. You know, demonstration I have given. So, then we can rewrite this like this. So, we can write it as f of x0 plus h equal to f of x0 plus f dash of x0. Now, x1 minus x0 is h. So, times h plus half f double dash at x0 times x1 minus x0 is h. So, h squared. So, this that's why we call them order of h squared terms like that. Okay. And uh, so, you see, if I were to know, if I get x1, once I know the value of the function at x1, then I can calculate the value of the function at x2. Right? So, that means in general, if I have the value of the function at xi, I think slightly going fast, I hope you will be catching it up. Then I will have f of xi plus h to be equal to f of xi. Okay? So, xi plus h is nothing but xi plus 1. Okay? And this is f double da f dash of xi into h plus half f double dash of xi into h squared etc. Okay?